Are you concerned and perhaps even extremely bothered that your cat's outdoor fun time adventures have opened the door to another family? Are you worried that your cat, the pet that you love so very much, has developed a new relationship, perhaps a better relationship with someone else? In today's video, I'll give you seven signs, some more subtle than others, that could tip you off to the fact that your cat isn't leaving home to play. They're leaving your home for their second home. Stay tuned. When it comes to the signs to look for, we'll start things off with the look itself, your cat's appearance. Take it all in, the big picture. Does your cat look different? Over the course of a few weeks or even a few months, have things changed? Has your cat put on a bit more weight, even though you are feeding them the same? Have they put on more weight, even though they play outside each and every day? What about your cat's fur? Is your cat's fur a bit shorter? Has it been cut in some fashion? If your cat's physical appearance has changed, and the changes are rather unexplainable from your side of things, your pet could have a second family. Next up, let's talk appetite. If your once hungry pet with a robust appetite suddenly starts shying away from the food bowl, even shying away from the food and snack treats that at one time they just could not resist, your cat looks happy and looks healthy yet doesn't want to eat at all. This probably means that they're receiving meals elsewhere. The body doesn't lie. If your cat has fattened up a bit yet will not eat, that alone is a major red flag. Another sign that your cat has a second family deals with scent changes. Your cat has a scent, perhaps you've never really noticed it, but your cat's got a scent. And if your cat is sort of messing around behind your back, your pet will start to track in a new scent. The longer your cat is around other people, especially cuddled up in a home environment, the more your cat will begin to smell like those other people. And while you might not be able to pick up your cat's natural scent, if Garfield starts to smell like the perfume that you do not own, well, well, another red flag. Another sign involves something that is a bit less subtle, and that's simply staying out longer than usual, longer than ever before. If your cat's time in the neighborhood has gone from, say, 60 minutes each day to three, four, five hours, and that has become the new normal, chances are they're not just stalking some mouse, they're doing something else. And that something else could involve spending quality time with their new family. And whether by their own doing or perhaps some coaxing and even some physical manipulation, your cat could be staying out late simply because they're behind the closed doors of the house that's three, down, <laughs> that's three doors down from your very own. If your pet just never seems to be around, that could be due to the fact they're hanging around other people. The next sign involves behavioral changes. I mean, if your cat has been doing a lot of the above, there's really no way they won't change. After all, our cats over time, well, they somewhat become quite similar to us. They adopt our personalities, and if your cat has suddenly changed, it likely has nothing to do with anything that you've done. Your pet is slowly taking on the personality of their second family. Your cat may start to dislike things they once enjoy, like things they used to hate, sleep in new places, suddenly give members of your family the cold shoulder while getting perhaps closer with others. And make no mistake, the concept of behavioral changes and a second family doesn't always involve distancing. Some cats become closer with their primary family simply because they've missed that side of the attention pool. Swim with one family and then come back for a swim with the other. <laughs> Let's just state the obvious here. Everything about this topic, the undertone is, well, cheating. When a cheater comes back, are they distant or loving? Sometimes they're loving in an effort to throw you off the scent. Same can be true for Garfield. Another sign that your cat has another family can simply involve some folks in your neighborhood just casually outside calling for a cat. Not calling your cat by name, just calling for a cat. Perhaps they place some food near the door, their front door, and they're just wondering if the cat that, you know, usually comes around is around in that moment. And to your surprise, the cat they're seeking could be yours. It's certainly possible for your neighbor to be totally and honestly unaware that the cat they've been caring for belongs to you. In fact, at this very moment, I cater to a cheating cat. This cat is around all the time, and this cat very much belongs to someone else. So yes, I'm catering to a cheater just about seven days a week. Scandalous. <laughs> I am the second family. Cue the dramatic music. 
And finally, a bit earlier, I spoke about, let's say, not coming home in a timely fashion. That outdoor time now spans hours. Well, what about this little wrinkle? What if you go outside, you see your cat, but they just ignore you? Whereas before, they'd be more than happy to see you and run to the front door. Now they just sort of look at you, seemingly refusing to enter your home. If your cat does have a second family, that means they have options. If your pet is ignoring you, it could be that they're waiting for that other door to open, quite literally. Why come home when I could just as well go to my other home? Decisions, decisions. And there you have it, seven, some more subtle than others, uh, signs that your cat probably could, possibly, <laughs> have another home, a second home, a second family. To the audience of Senior Cat Wellness, does your cat have a second home? Has it been confirmed? And how about this one? Are you the second family? Are you the cheating family? Do you cater to a cat that belongs to someone else in your neighborhood? If you have a story to share, please let me know in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed today's content, please give this video a like and subscribe to the channel. I'd love to have you as a part of the Senior Cat Wellness family. And until next time, thank you so much for watching, and I'll talk to you later.